The B2ME HT thermostat is a high temperature pulse type thermostat that has an automatic nighttime drop facility. The B2ME HT controls the temperature by pulsing power to the heater to control at your set temperature. The B2ME HT is extremely accurate at monitoring and controlling the temperature inside the vivarium. The B2ME HT can control up to 600 watt of heaters and does not have a minimum load so is suitable for all non light emitting type of heaters for example ceramics, heat mats and heat cable. The HT version uses a higher temperature range than the standard model which is ideal for reptiles that require hotter temperatures such as bearded dragons and euromastics. Setting up the B2ME HT is really easy. The thermostat should be positioned so that it can see a change in light level, for example facing a window. There is a light sensor situated behind the reptile eye on the front of the thermostat. Connect the mains power cable from the thermostat to a plug socket near your vivarium. The green power LED will illuminate whenever the thermostat is powered on. Next, plug the heater that you are using into the heater socket on the thermostat. Positioning of the sensor is very important to allow you to achieve a temperature gradient inside the vivarium. The sensor is coated black to allow it to measure radiant heat which is the best way to measure the air temperature inside the vivarium. The sensor should be positioned at least 9 inches away from the heat source. The sensor should not be fixed flat against the wall of the vivarium as this will give the thermostat false readings. We recommend the sensor should be at least 4 inches from the walls of the vivarium. The sensor measures the temperature at the tip of the probe, which means the end of the vivarium nearer the heater will be warmer than the set temperature and the end farthest from the heater will be cooler. This gives your vivarium the temperature gradient that is required to allow your reptile to move into the heat or away from it to cool down. The only exception to this is if you have no option but to install a heat mat inside the vivarium. We do not recommend installing a heat mat under substrate inside the vivarium as this restricts the airflow across the heat mat, but if this is your only option, the sensor must be placed directly on top of the heat mat and then the temperature dial adjusted to achieve your required temperature inside the vivarium. Setting the temperature on the B2ME HT is very simple. The left temperature control dial with the symbol of the sun is used to set the daytime temperature. The daytime temperature can be controlled from 29 to 45 degrees Celsius. Simply turn the adjuster clockwise to set the temperature that is required by your reptile. The right temperature control dial with the symbol of the moon is used to set the nighttime temperature drop. Please note this is a drop in temperature. So for example, if your daytime temperature is set to 30 degrees and you require the nighttime temperature to be 25 degrees, set the right hand dial to 5 degrees. Or if you require the temperature to drop to 20 degrees, then the right hand dial should be set to a 10 degree drop. The temperature can be dropped between 0 and 14 degrees from the daytime temperature. The temperature control dials are anti-tamper, which means you will need to use a small flathead screwdriver to adjust it. The reason for this is that the temperature cannot be accidentally knocked or adjusted by a child. The green power LED on the thermostat will be lit whenever the thermostat is plugged into the mains. The yellow LED allows you to see how much power is being sent from the thermostat to the heater. It will be on solid when full power is being sent to the heater. As less heat is required to maintain the set temperature, the LED will begin to pulse. The shorter the pulse is, the less heat is required to be sent to the heater. When no heat is required, the yellow LED will be off. 
The red LED indicates if the thermostat is in day or night mode. When the thermostat is operating in day mode, the red LED will be off. When the light level changes and the thermostat switches to night mode, the red LED will be on. The light level adjuster is located on the bottom of the thermostat next to where the sensor is fitted to the thermostat. The light level adjuster comes factory set at midway in its adjustment range. To fine tune the light level that is required to switch the thermostat into night mode, the light level adjuster can be turned either clockwise to require it to get darker before switching into night mode or anti-clockwise for the thermostat to switch into night mode sooner. The nighttime drop mode can be disabled if required by setting the drop temperature to zero. Then irrespective of what the light level is set to, the thermostat will control at the daytime setting. All microclimate thermostats come with a five year warranty for your peace of mind. All microclimate products are designed and manufactured in the United Kingdom. For more information and to see the other products in the microclimate range, please visit our website www.microclimate.co.uk